I'm going to do is speak by Lori Halt Anderson. I'm sorry for not having this book present because I read it on my iPhone, but the book speak, speaks for itself, unpun intended. What I choose that is very dear and I love it so much is when people don't express themselves, they die one piece at a time, page 122. And I love this quote because sometimes it's too relatable can appeal to this quote because everyone was reluctant to speak at one point. This quote means that if Melinda soon doesn't reveal her secret and express her true feelings, then she will slowly disintegrate. Melinda Sergino has a dry outlook on the world and muddles her way through freshman year, but in the beginning she can come across whiny and very irritating, but then you grew to share compassion and love for sarcastic humor. It's a character later revealed in a book, and it is a boy frigger who can be classified as sleazy, attractive, and is included in the popular crowd. Reputations have stained others and himself, and he did not only change Melinda's life, but he attempted his actions towards others. It's set in Netherware High School, Syracuse, New York, where a teenage girl named Melinda begins her freshman year. Melinda tends to gravitate away from the social events, so we follow when she retreats back into her mind, where she battles dealing with what had occurred and gives us slight indications to why the whole high school backfired on her and they kind of shun her and despise her. We also look at her tattered family and friend relationship and why she is so oppressed by it. Two distinctive themes that come across when I read this book and it's the idea of growing up and finding the inner strength of the character. Growing up because most high school students suffer the trauma Melinda had to dealt with and strength of character because this book is a journal of Melinda and how she grew and became to overlook others' opinion and finally telling the truth. She was mentally and physically drained, but she found a way to gather up all her courage and find her path back. I realize I've been raving, but Speak hits so many vital issues for teens. It's a heart pulling emotional experience, the sense of desolation, fear, and unwilling to express all of the above, combined with sarcasm and hilarious dry observation, sucks me in and I'll do the same for you. I finish and after finishing Speak, I don't feel like a reader who picks up the book, but I feel like a nurturing friend that resembles some characteristics of Melinda. But firstly, I'd like to point out that I do like myself some social events. I this book to any teen because it gives us an honest insight on the hellhole commonly known as high school. And it deals with common teenage issues and that if we have a voice, we should use it instead of shunning ourselves from the world. But read this book and I hope you enjoy it.